In this video I'm going to review the RCA portable dishwasher that I purchased myself so I received no compensation or monetary payment for reviewing this product. Now I'm going to begin with some of the things I really like about this product. As you can see on the front control panel of the machine there's not an awful lot to choose with. It basically has three programs and uh, they all work just fine. I leave it in the normal mode all the time and the dishes come out superb. The one thing that I really like is the actual height of this particular machine. It's exactly, now I don't know whether this is just by chance, it's exactly the height, 36 inches, of my countertops. So it forms an instant island and the island is also on its own casters so it is superb for adding extra counter space to a small kitchen. It has a stainless steel tub and two racks for loading your dishes. Surprising can get a good day's dishes in there without any problem. The nice thing too it has two spray bars. There's a spray bar in the bottom hitting the bottom tray and there's a spray bar in the middle uh, that sprays the secondary tray. You don't often find that in a portable dishwasher. Like in most dishwashers the soap dispenser is located in the door and there's two size cups there. I use the second cup, the larger of the two. find that works best. The other thing that I found out was that you must use a jet dry in this dishwasher. My first few loads were not very good because I didn't have that jet dry to put into my dishwasher. But using the jet dry the loads come out spotless and perfectly clean. Now the dishwasher is surprisingly quiet. The noisiest part of the dishwasher cycle is when it ejects the water into the sink. And uh, other than that uh, our sitting area is just next to our small kitchen here where we watch TV and uh, it's got so we hardly even notice it now. We've had the dishwasher in service for about three months now and as I say I'm really happy with the uh, the way it cleans the dishes. The only drawback that I and dislike I guess that I would have with it is the hoses. The hoses are very stiff and they don't really retract back into the back of the dishwasher very easily and they don't retract at all. You have to pretty well squeeze them down in through the the back cubby that they give you and it often gets hung up with the electrical cord so that would be the only real drawback that I can see to this machine is it's a little difficult to put away but I can live with that. The other hint that I'd like to leave with you is that when you load your dishwasher like I've done here and you push the top tray in make sure you push it in firmly it's kind of a seal at the back where the because it carries its own wash uh, sprayer and that goes in and slightly clicks into place. First couple of times I did that I don't think I was getting full pressure to my top tray. So just push that in firmly, load your cups and hook her up and you're away. Very happy with this little dishwasher. I give it a five star rating. There's nothing I can really see wrong with it. Uh, it does what it's supposed to do and it provides a secondary thing and that is the extra counter space that I can use as an island, put it anywhere, put my little plastic protector on top, or use it as a cutting board and I am very very happy with this little machine. So until the next review, this is Ray at the Handyman's Haven wishing you all the best.